Now, Bruce, I assure you it won't happen again. Look, let me buy you a drink at the club and we'll... I dare say there's no need for language like that. Bruce? Bruce? Meet Irving Jeffries, a reputable solicitor in the big city. Jeffries has just lost a major client because an important document was not filed by the required date. The news will be the talk of the town by cocktail hour, and Jeffries may have to wait until the next financial quarter before he can afford his third summer house. Like any good boss, Jeffries understands that incidents such as these must be handled with accountability and fairness. Foster! Why the devil didn't you file that document by the required time? I tried, sir. I left it with your secretary for you to approve. And I reminded you on three separate occasions. I don't care how many times you reminded me! It's your fault and that's that! From here on, you'll do twice the work for half the pay, and I don't want to hear another word about it! Yes, sir. Brown! Yes, sir. It's your fault, too. But I had nothing to do with the matter. You're fired! But accountability doesn't stop there. A public announcement can help to clear the air. The legal profession has come a long way since then, but we've still got a long way to go. Fortunately, we as lawyers now have access to tools that can really make a difference. The Tristan Jepson Memorial Foundation is here to help. I know my team use the Tristan Jepson Memorial Foundation guidelines as a blueprint for a psychologically healthy legal team. I really encourage you to visit the website to see how it can help you.